Shout out to Alvin, who's going to let us work out. The owner of this gym is deployed overseas right now, so he was, you know, letting us come here, and he was, I can't even think of the word. For it. We got exclusive access to one of the best gyms over here in Pinellas Park, okay? This gym has been opened up by my boy Alvin Johnson. He is a uh, military veteran. He is currently deployed on orders right now as a military contractor. This isn't just a regular gym that has, you know, all right, we just came in here, we got a whole bunch of prime, prime equipment. No, this is the best pieces from each and every company from old school to new school. I promise you we are going to have an absolute blast here. And we're gonna crush some legs, let's go. Let's Bro, this place is actually very nice. Alvin, you did a great job. It feels like a definitely bodybuilding gym. This is what we need in Sarasota, something like this. I might actually, I'll probably most definitely come here for my prep. He went crazy. I didn't think he was. I didn't think he was like. I didn't think he went this like bro, this beyond is, this is for this he gym. That's the actual grip. Yeah, bro, this is no joke. You don't, know, bro. Like, oh, this is two and one. Look at this. Yeah, it's a two and one. Oh, I'm Damn. not a contractor. Screw it. Like, look at. Yeah. Nah, wait. Is this soldered? Hell yeah, it is. Like the way they. That's not normal. Like, is that design or that's like soldered? Yeah, that's right here, this hack squat is a very, very sought after hack squat. Why is it's one? Because it's one of the originals, man. It just, there's just nothing that really hits like this. What do you mean by that? The smoothness of it, the feel of it, it's just it's incomparable. I typically just warm up with like glutes and hamstrings, and then I slowly go into like a, a quad focused workout. You know, usually that's usually a compound, like heavy. So like either a leg press, a hack squat, sometimes a Smith squat, but I haven't been doing Smiths. But in my hamstrings and glutes, so we're just gonna slowly work up to it. I love this machine, shit, it really has me locked in. I'm already sweating, bro. So my rep range is usually around 10 to 12 reps. First set's like a pre-exhaust. Wake my legs up, get some blood flow in there. And then I'll slowly start going into like heavy movements. Like these next three sets, they're gonna be a little bit more heavier. Obviously I wanna get more control. So I'm really focusing on feeling all of my hamstring throughout the movement and the exercise, especially when I'm doing the negatives. And honestly, that's the best way to get some activation in your hamstrings, personally. That's what I feel a lot. So that's something that's been helping me a lot during this off season as we go into the new prep. Yeah, yeah, dude, I gotta train my hamstring. Here, uh, control this. You're doing classic or men's disease? All right, come on, we gotta train the legs. Engage your hamstring. There you go, take your time on the way down. Got the good old little hack squat, old school vibes, AKA the humbler over here. This, this machine right here, the hack squat has actually been my favorite exercise currently, because it targets pretty much, essentially more so your quads, but you get a little bit of everything, you know, hamstrings, quads, glutes, depending on how you position your feet as well. This is definitely my go-to on my leg days. This way. Oh. Oh. Let's go. Oh. We got how many reps now, Dustin? Huh? How many reps is that? Twelve. All right. I'll try it. You got it. Come on. Huh? Come on, you get twelve. You got it. Huh? You got twelve, bro. That's what I'm here for. Come on. Around you. Get twelve. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Fucking push, come on, you gotta grow. Get this shit. Get this shit, come on. Push. Yeah. There you go. Easy work, come on. Yep, come on, come on. Easy day. Yep, all you. There you go. Four. Come on. Let's go. Come on. 
Work, work, come on. Come on. Six. Six more, come on, six more. Come on. Come on. There you go. Go, don't think. Up. That's eight. Let's go. Four more. Go. Push, come on. Come on. Four. Come on. Go. Come on. Don't think. Three. Don't think. Go. Two. Last one. Last one. All the way down. All the way down. Good shit, good shit, good shit like bro. <sighs> hey, dude. <sighs> good work, bro. Good work. I'll tell you, grow. 12 reps, right? Too, my legs are too overpowered right now. If I if I train them twice a week, they're just they're just gonna keep on growing. And my upper body's still gonna. Are you doing open or? I'm doing classic, but I got a lot of feedback from my last show. Was pretty much put a lot of emphasis on my upper body. Uh, my lower body's good. It doesn't mean I'm training. I've stopped training them hard. It just means I don't have to train them that That's many much. that many times a week. Yeah. So, because classic, it's all about proportions and aesthetics. That's how you fuck right there. Oh. Taking a fucking knee like football. Shit, that was hard. But that's how you gotta grow and train. Two for two on this. Hey, uh, Damn. <laughs> yeah. uh, I feel better now. You have a trash? You have a trash? Yeah. Oh, man. I'll clean it up. It's fine. Oh. I'll, grab, I'll grab it afterwards. Okay. Don't clean it up. I got it. This is a good day. This is good. work now. I feel better, though. <laughs> At what point did you felt this? Was it the hack squat? It was like when I was just chilling. Bro, <laughs> did you get that on camera? Yeah. All right, good shit. So what happened was, I feel better now, but I had like this this funny, I had a funny feeling in my stomach, and I was like, just chilling. Like this has happened like two minutes after I got off that. And I was like, dude, I feel something coming. I knew I knew it was gonna come out. So in the trash can, next thing you know, liquid and just blue shit comes out, and it was definitely the pre-workout. Not even the food, just the pre-workout. Yeah, you don't want to sure. take. You know, it's too much pre-workout. Too much pre-workout. You know. That's that's honestly that's you love and you hate when you throw up though, because it's the, the feeling of throwing up in that moment. But once it's over with, you just you feel refreshed. <laughs> 
Wrap up the leg day for today's workout. I know you guys didn't see much of the workout, but we pretty much wanted to show you guys the most intense part of the video. We got too carried away with the workout that I literally forgot to film. Um, but it was just one of those days where we just came in here and just fucked shit up with the boys. And I did throw up. I'm not gonna lie, you guys saw in the clip, I threw up, obviously, but hey man, you gotta grow, you gotta keep fucking training hard. I have so much content planned out for you guys. I know I'll be uploading way more and show you guys the whole journey and the process. And I, get, I can't wait, man. It's going to be exciting because we're going for the pro card. I'm going to get that shit. So, see you guys. Peace.